This is this video is about the model based reflex agents. I look into the working and the diagram of model based reflex agents with examples. If you look at the diagram of a, or architecture of a model based reflex agents, then like all the intelligent agents, it will have a sensor, it will have an actuator, and it will act in the environment. But what makes this different from the simple based reflex agent is that it is able to store its precept history or its sensor history in or the actions it has done in some sort of working memory or the knowledge base so this will enable the agent to make informed decisions based on the intelligence it has gained or learned throughout a period of its working history also this kind of agent will consider the facts like how the world will evolve or what will be the change or effect of the action of the agent on its environment and the agent will act based on the condition action rules so summing up and describing the function of this kind of agent a model based agent can handle partially observable environments so it will also take into consideration of the its actions on the environment and it will consider the fact like how the world or how its environment will evolve or the evolution algorithm of its environment will be fitted into the agent's memory or memory and this will enable the agent to take in various decisions uh, if the current state is stored inside the agent maintaining some kind of structure this describes the part of the world which cannot be seen so the part of the world which cannot be seen will be stored in the memory or the algorithms in the knowledge base of the agent and this knowledge about how the world works is called a model of the world a model based on the reflex agent should maintain some sort of internal model that depends on the precept history also it has a model of how the world will evolve and how the world will work so the world was working or the environment was into action even before the agent was put into there so based on the previous history or the evolution history of the environment that information will put into the agents knowledge base based on the algorithms and this will enable the agent to take or consider while doing certain actions for example if you consider a mass lander after picking up its first sample it will store this in the internal state and so if it comes across a second sample of the same kind it can ignore that sample and it can save the space for other samples so this is how the agent or the model in case of a mass lander will take into consideration the precept history by storing it in the state of the model as you can see in the previous diagram so these are the references for this and we will also look into the simple based agent and model based agent consideration further the so if you consider the house cleaning robot and this could store in its memory where it find where it finds dust every week so if it finds dust every week under the sofa so it could store that in its memory and the next time it will go into the function of cleaning or uh, it could directly look under the sofa for the dust again in the case of a mass lander it will have to consider the effect of its action this have to be feeded through algorithm so like it should consider the effect of its action like not pulling a supporting rock which could crush it so such kind of situations should be feeded through algorithm into the working memory into the knowledge base of the agent so if you look at the simple based agent so the simple ba simple reflex agent so it will directly consider the precept and it will do actions without considering the previous precept history or the state in this case of a model based agent or also it will not consider how the world evolves as in case of a model based agent it will consider how the world evolves that is a model of the world before the agent was put into the put into that environment or the world will be stored through algorithms in the working mem in the knowledge base of the agent and that will enable the agent to make certain actions also the agent will consider the effect of his actions on the environment so that's how a model based agent is different from a simple reference that's all if you like this video please do subscribe like and comment